Miss Orange. Oh, hi, Very Kinboil. Thank you so much for getting me this pogo stick. Very thoughtful of you. Oh, look what I can do now. Oh, it helps when you're busy. But do you ever get busy? Oh, no, it's fun. And I love the built-in hoppometer. Jadybug, did a package come into the post office back there for Berrykin Bloom? It's definitely one of these. Oh, watch out! Oh! Oh. oh, here it is. Well, do you think it's the vacation brochure you've been waiting for? Uh, well, you see. You must be so excited. Finally going on a vacation. Well, actually, uh, I'm not going. You aren't? Well, I decided it was more important to buy these special berry seeds. So I can't afford a vacation just now. These new berry plants will really do great things for the berry works and everyone in Berry Bitty City. Oh, but Berry can bloom. You gave up your vacation last year to sit with my sick petunias. And the year before that to help bring in the berry harvest. <sighs> Maybe next year. Well, I'd better get these seeds into pots. Wait, don't you want to see the new issue of Berry Bitty World Traveler? Oh, I'll, uh... Take a look when I'm closer to taking the vacation. Works too hard, that bloom. Not good for a berrykin. Hi, Orange. I just saw Berrykin Bloom, and he seemed not very happy. Fantastic! Well, not really. I'd say more sort of mm, sad. No, I mean, look! The magazine is holding a contest. Anyone who can break a Berry Bitty World record wins a vacation of their dreams. That's what'll cheer up Berry Can Bloom, a vacation. And I have an idea how to get him one. It's a very good idea, Orange. Good. Oh, it's great. Berry Can Bloom really deserves a vacation. But breaking a world record to get him one? What can we do that's world record worthy? Well, what are we all good at? You're an expert cook. Raspberry's an amazing fashion designer. <laughs> and Plum, you're such a talented dancer. <laughs> Thank you. We're all good at lots of things. So which one of us should try and break a record? Well, that's my other idea. If we all try to break a record, each of us doing something different, we'd have a better chance of one of us winning the contest. Oh, let's do it! Orange, you're in charge. Oh, uh, okay. The Berry Bitty World Record is twice as high as this souffle. Well, gotta keep trying. Shh, don't tell. Berry can bloom. Good day, Miss Shortcake. Good morning. Any specials today? Uh, why, yes. Strawberry souffle. Oh, sounds delicious. I'll have some too, please. <laughs> Coming right up. As I was saying, Mr. Bloom, I've been reading this fascinating history of strange sicknesses, bizarre ailments that anyone could catch. <gasps> My goodness, how catchy are these, um, things we could catch? Oh, very catchy. Sneak up on you without warning. I'm on a chapter now about a disease called Goofa Lupus Wackyitis. It causes people to do strange, funny-looking things, things they've never done before and that don't make any sense. Enjoy. Mm, wonderful. Oh, thank you. Blueberry? Anything else?
else I can help with before I leave for lunch? No, that's everything, Boss the Bookworm. Thank you. Well, see you after lunch, then. See you, Bosley! Hello? Berry Bitty World Traveler Magazine? I'm calling about your contest for the free vacation. Well, I just wanted to let you know that there are some very big records that are about to be broken over here in Berry Bitty City. But... but... how many? I'd say about six records. Oh, I don't know what they'll be. <laughs> Just that they'll be big. Very big. You'll send an official contest, Judge? Friday? Perfect. Thank you so much. Goodbye. Well, it's all set. All set? But, Orange, I'm not sure we're prepared. Prepared? I've been stacking cans in my store for I don't know how long. I'm an expert, and that judge is going to see a stack of canned goods like never before. Uh, okay, but... but what? Remember, you're in charge. What should we do? Oh, I guess I kind of jumped ahead. I'm sorry. Um, okay. I'll make sure everyone has picked something to break a record with. Good idea. What are we gonna do? Maybe if I help you come up with something, it will help me come up with something. Oops. Oh, guess we're not going any higher. I can't stack them outside. They'll get dirty. <gasps> I know! How's it coming along, Raspberry? <laughs> well, I'm trying to make the very biggest dress ever. <laughs> I tried to make the smallest dress ever, but I couldn't see that small to make those silly stitches. Looking good. Keep at it. The contest judge is coming Friday. Oh, what? Looking good. Ah! Sorry, Lemon. I didn't mean to startle you. Oh, it's okay. It wasn't really record-breaking anyway. <sighs> I tried everything I can think of, even painting toenails faster than anyone did before. Ooh, how'd that work out? Oh. Well, think quick. You've got until the day after tomorrow. That's when the judge gets here. Merba Ernold Shoot Slipper? Oh, what? Ugh. The record for reading stuff upside down is safe. I simply cannot stand on my head for that long. I'm sorry. Good try, though. Having fun? You try and dance while walking on your hands. Hmm? <gasps> Show me. Uh, I don't think I can. I've been practicing for hours. But, okay, for you. That is incredible. Sick. Sick. Oh, no. Times many mountain the climb to try they. Treasure the find could they. Top the to get could they only if. Oh, that time was slower than the last. I'm not sure that breaking the record for reading backward is what I'm best at. Come on. We may be bitty, but I know we can do big things. Okay. <sighs> Times many mountain, the climb to try they. Treasure the find, could they top the to get, could they only if. Times many mountain, the climb to try they. Treasure the find, could they top the to get, could they only if. <laughs> oh dear. Berry can bloom? Uh, I was worried about... Uh... <laughs> oh, bitter berries. Plum? <laughs> what are you, uh, worried about? Well, uh, she, uh, I mean, uh, that is, uh, 
Miss Lemon, don't you think she's acting a bit strangely? Mm, no. But... Oh, well, you know, she just really loves to exercise. Oh. Oh, well, uh, if that's all it is. Would you like a mineral salt foot soak? <laughs> uh, no, thank you. I think I'd better get this plant into the ground. Well, uh, see you soon. I mean, around. Okay, bye. Ugh, foot soak. Good one, Lemon. Nothing I try seems good enough. In a record-breaking way, I mean. Not to mention, Barry Kim Bloom is getting suspicious. Which he wouldn't have if you hadn't been practicing your record-breaking in broad daylight. Where else can I practice? My studio's too small. Girls, please, let's not pick her. Who said that? She did. Why do we have to meet like this anyway? Because Barry Kim Bloom is out there tonight checking his night-blooming jasmines. I think my big dress is just silly. The judge is gonna laugh at me. Guys, guys, where's our can-do spirit? Orange is the only one who has can-do spirit. Stacking can-do spirit, that is. Ha, ha, ha. That's good, because... The person in charge should have can-do spirit. Being in charge is harder than I thought. Oh, come on, girls. You must be able to think of something, but not for me. Remember, this is for Berrykin Bloom. Hey! <laughs> to share ideas instead of doing it all alone. Maybe instead of cooking things, I could stack fruit. <laughs> the highest fruit tower in very many worlds. Yeah, and after you win, we can eat it. You know what, Strawberry? Your poofiest highest souffle idea gives me an idea too. Maybe I'll try a poofiest highest hairdo. Oh boy, that's terrific. Oh, but what about me? I'm running out of material for that big dress I'm stitching. That's it. What about a dress with the most stitches? I mean, you've done so many of them in that big dress already, and no one can stitch faster than you. Oh, yes! Thank you, Blueberry. I'm using it. And you know what? No one can read out loud faster than you. Why don't you go for the record of reading really fast instead of upside down and backwards and, well, you know. I can't believe I didn't think of that before. Thanks, Raspberry. See, girls? I knew we could do it if we helped inspire each other a little. What about you, Plum? Uh, I don't know. What about pirouettes? Oh, the most pirouettes in a row! Hey, yeah! Girls, we've got it! All our worries are over! Skipping backwards, eh? Yes, and Miss Orange has been taking her merchandise and stacking it outside. Oh, a classic case of goofa lupus wackyitis. Thank goodness you brought this to my attention. There's no time to lose. Oh, dear. Uh, but are you sure that we need to bring the doctor? Very sure. Today's the day! You ready? Wow! You look like the world's biggest souffle! Is that good? No. That's great! Are you off and running? Uh, po-going? Well, yes. I'll let you hop to it, then. See you later! A wise old owl lived in an oak. The more he saw, the less he spoke. The less he spoke, the more he heard. Why can't we all be like that wise old bird? A wise old owl lived in an oak. The more he saw, the less he spoke. The less he spoke, the more he heard. Why can't we all be like that wise old bird? Oh. 
not fast enough for the world record. Faster, faster! The judge is coming this way! Kawhi saw the owl lived in an oak the more he saw, the less he spoke! <laughs> it's so good of you to come, Dr. Nutby. At first it was just Miss Plum, but then it seemed to spread. Oh, my. Hmm, I personally have never come across this. You'd best inform Princess Berrikin. No telling how far this is going to spread. <sighs> Tragic. Very sad. What can be done? I'd better see the other patients. The judge is around the corner. Oh, keep moving. Miss Barang, are you in there? Oh, oh, I'll be right there! <gasps> huh? Oh no, wait! I'm shrinking it as poofy as it was! Uh, poofier even! Miss Barang, she has other girls she needs to see. You're right. It wouldn't be fair. I've never seen anything like this. What do you think? I think you better stop, Miss Plum. Oh, well. I just get too dizzy. Dizziness. Hmm. But wait until you see Raspberry. We were just on our way. Now, now. It's best not to exert yourself, my dear. Oh, no. You mean you can already tell? It doesn't have enough stitches. Oh! Well, I'm sure you'll be amazed by what Strawberry is doing. Yes, I'm sure we will. I'm afraid this is beyond medical science. It is worse than you described. I'm going to call in more doctors. There's no telling how far this could spread. You didn't get to take a measurement. I'm going to take your temperature. I've never seen anything so severe in all my days as a doctor. Doctor? Dr. Hazelnutby. Now, stick out your tongue, say, ah, uh, and tell uh, me, why have you been stacking fruit? To break a world record so we can win the contest. <sighs> she believes she's in a contest. But, but we are in a contest, all of us. Aren't you the judge? I'm the doctor. Mr. Longface called me in to help you because you are all sick. But we're not sick. Now, girls, you can't deny your strange behavior. Hopping and twirling. And stacking cans and cartwheeling and... We were trying to help Orange win a vacation for you. A vacation? For me? If we break a very bitty world record, we'll win a free vacation from the travel magazine. And we... we're going to give it to you. Oh, oh dear. That's the most wonderful... I can't believe it. But we failed. I don't think we failed. Orange, you really took charge and inspired us to do much better. <laughs> Higher, bigger, faster than we all imagined we could. Even if none of us broke a world record. Uh, but one of you did break a world record. We did? How do you know? I am the contest judge from the magazine. You? Bosley Bookworm? Yes, they have representatives all over. My, it is hard keeping up with you girls. My stack of cans? <gasps> is that how we broke the record? No, your pogo stick bounces. I have been counting them since I saw you on it a while ago. And look, your hopometer confirms it. You've had ten more continuous bounces than the old record holder. <laughs> Congratulations, Berry Kinbloom. The girls have won you a dream vacation to anywhere in the world. I don't know what to say. I'm just so relieved they don't have a goofaloop. Uh, what was it? Goofaloopus wackyitis. It's all right here in my medical book. Goofa what? 
Oh, Mr. Longface, this isn't a medical book, it's a joke book. It is? Yes, it's just a comedy book full of silly made-up maladies. My goodness, uh, I, I'm very sorry. I guess uh, <laughs> the joke's on me. Don't worry, Mr. Longface, it all worked out. Now that my Tower of Fruit is on the ground, who wants to come in the cafe and celebrate Verican Bloom's vacation with a big helping of... <laughs> Strawberry Souffle! called Ponyville, anything can happen. Really? Come on! It's where adventure arrives at a full gallop. Let's go! And where friendship comes with something extra. Magic! My Little Pony Friendship is Magic, coming up next, right here at The Hub, where friends come together.